that career high 21 kills against Utah Tech. Ball sent back onto Toledo's side, the chance for Alt. Nice up from Hannah Grant, the chance for Murray. Perfectly placed on that back line. No chance situation for the Rockets. Grant serves a tough one and Ray can't handle it. Give the ace. They actually gave it to Michigan there. I I'm surprised. Must have been overturned. That's A-OK -okay for the Wolverine fans out there. Brilliant pass forward from Murray. The block goes out of bounds. Felici Nyambio back into the match. A great serve, can't quite handle it. Granger sends it into the net. It's an ace for Hannah Grant. In the game against Toledo, we saw a similar substitution. Haley Halgram was still in the game. There's another ace for the Wolverines. They now lead 18-5. One of the things that makes Hannah Grant such a special player, able to put that as a pass that's on target, sets up the offense for that kill, and turns around and gets an ace. Wants to pull ahead here, they're gonna have to and keep passing. The perfect pass forward, the quick strike sent back. Now Michigan's turn, down goes to Merzik. Hitchman able to get underneath it. Here we go again. Down with plenty of options. And Michigan takes their first lead of the afternoon. Here in the third set, Hitchman plays forward, just a little touch, timing a little bit off, and oh boy, the scramble, and Hannah Grant sneaks the in the kill. Um, a, a bad pass into a great play. Mershek heads back to serve now. Halgren plays it forward, options for Dowd, the attack from Murray, down again. 18 kills for Kendall Murray. Push it out of bounds. Uh, that's what we've been looking for all, all night. <laughs> Miscommunication on the Loyola side. McNabb and Hinchman. <laughs> Haley Halgren's serve handled by Hinchman. The attack from the middle, but Venuto put up by Halgren. Chance coming for Merzik. Perfectly placed. What a set. Block to Jackie Boney's tally. Hannah Grant serve, another good one. Henchman can't handle it. 23-14, Wolverines on top. Jess Robinson and Kendall Murray up front. Hannah Grant serve, a good one in between two Ramblers. McNabb and Mersek not really communicating. That ball goes out of bounds. Ace for Grant. Great serve and an ace. Grant's team leading 18th. Another tremendous serve and another ace. Back to back for Grant. Fifth serve for Michigan. And the sixth is coming up. Here in the fourth set. No chance, there's the ace for Michigan. Number seven here tonight. 21-15. And wow, one and up. Chance for Kendall Murray. Bowling Green, the swing from Androva. Turned aside, but it's back on Michigan's side. A little bit of pinball action, but off the block and for a kill, Jess Robinson. Brings a lot to the table. She's not played a full game since the DePaul match. And how about that, a dig to kill. It's Johnson's serve. BG's attack from Meyer put up by Grant. Back row attack coming. Another swing for BG, perfectly placed. Alex LeBoy into the match. Had a couple of aces and a couple of digs against Mississippi State. She can't handle the serve her direction from Hannah Grant. Going for the high hands, wanting to find a fingertip or two for the tool. Hannah Grant with another ace for Michigan, their eighth of the match. 
play. But also defense. You want to be able to dig the ball high enough to the front of the court so that the slide attacker can have an attempt. Jess Merzik blocked up front by Ohio State. Difficult ball to the net. Michigan has it on their side. On the quick, Riley Rader got back her own block. Merzik muscles that one through for a Michigan point. An interesting connection there between those two families. That's a great point as Riley Rader runs the slide. Scotty Johnson, number four for Michigan, the center right now, who just made that bump pass, is a native of Ohio. She's from Dayton. Goodness gracious, Jess Merzik. <laughs> Ohio State trying to hand them their first loss in conference play. It's almost a skyhook from Adria Powell there. Here's Emily Londi, who opens the third set with a point for Ohio State. Right in the middle, we'll see what play they run here in rotation one. Pedraza sets Gonzalez, who's had the hot hand tonight for Ohio State. Back to her. Kept alive. Powell got it over, but it's a point for Michigan. And we have Amber Beals in for Protoski serving. Very prescient call, Audrey. Ball knocked all over the place, and Hannah Grant can't get kills as a libero. But... <laughs> playing fearlessly, and they're playing smart. This heads up play by Grant. Gonzalez with a tough angle shot, but it was dug by Grant. Merzik eats up Londa. It kills three errors, 15 attacks. Raider saved by Grant. Dug by Murr. Down to Robinson, automatic. Sure, she's really focused on becoming a team leader. And here she sends the serve over the net. Robinson takes the swing. Thomas Ilara for the Wildcats. Rousseau sets Catherine Randor. Murray takes the swing, blocked right back over by the Wildcats. Kratowski takes a swing and a violation called against Northwestern, point for Michigan. Welcome back inside Welch Ryan Arena, Jacob Pavlak and Max Toma with you. And Lonnie Dodson takes a swing for Northwestern. Michigan an early four point advantage, now make it five at the 11-6 Wolverines lead here at set number one. Could be in for a five setter potential just the way it's looking. Both teams trading points back and forth. Diving stop by the libero, Miller. Now Thomas Ilara goes cross court, dug out by Pertovsky. Rousseau setting Becker in a nice pancake dig by Maggie Dowd for the Wolverines. And put away by Kathleen Randor for the Wildcats. Trailing by three in the fourth set. Johnson going to Lisiak. Now back to Lisiak for the swing. Portovsky with the tip. Joust the top of the net, kept alive by the Wolverines. And now the push by the libero, Hannah Grant. There, just catches Northwestern by surprise. You don't see this coming, and it's right in an no man's land in the middle. Coach Rosen talking about loosest kid on the team, but big time competitive streak. Wolverines going to need more of that. They try to work back in this match. Grant going to the outside. And there you go. Michigan finally getting. And which led to a perfect tempo ball um, for Merzik. I'm sorry. Another serving opportunity for Johnson. Big dig there by Grant. Nice. Big dig there by Rodriguez. Great pickup. Wow, and Rodriguez got that one. Everybody's playing horizontally right now. Murray dug out again that time, Lonstein. 
This point's going on forever. Lonstein got it. Merzik gets the kill. Now she'll serve for Michigan. What a dig by Hannah Grant. Johnson laid out for that one as Robinson comes in for Boney. Hannah Grant with another excellent dig. Issa Lopez struggles to receive. Championship last year. One of the best matches I've ever watched the five setter against Nebraska. In front of a huge crowd. Back row attack from Julia Orzel. Boney got it in. So here's Maddie Dowd, the other setter for Michigan in that 6-2. Wisconsin also using a 6-2 offense. Great up from down. It saves it. MJ Hamill going to stick with Crawford in the middle. Wow, Maddie Dowd is all over the court right now. And May Potofsky. <laughs> service pressure when Michigan turns it on. Scoring from the service line, another good pace serve. Wow, those are the first two aces for Michigan today. But I think one of the changes we've seen from Ohio State as of late is more balls to the middle. They are really running their middles a lot here in Big Ten play. Nice contact. Good dig into the cross court that time by Grant. The Libero for Michigan returning the favor on Murr. Oh, Gonzalez gets a little bit of a facial, a stuff on the outside. Well, we showed you the balance, the number of players on their offensive side averaging three kills. Working on Genesia Moore. Nice dig. And a Grant, the Libero for Michigan. Set a little bit tight, smart shot. Nicely done by Allison Jacobs off the edge of the block and down. As you can see how they've gone to some other options there, but now we see Kendall Murray playing on the outside as well as Mira Chopra into the match. And how about that fortunate deflection? Van Fair serves at Allison Jacobs. And Jacobs has to poke it over, setting it free. Shaft faster. That's looked over by Wenis. We've had four pancakes. Both Liberos just doing a great job. Knows how to get there, get a hand on the ball. And that's Hannah Grant, the Libero. And that goes off. The In brief spurt so far today. Jackie Boney comes through. As she checks back into the game following that kill from Boney. Hannah Grant on to serve. Miscommunication there from Charlotte Cronister. Grace Reininga, the junior from Leewood, Kansas, back to serve for the Wildcats. Hannah Grant is there. Boney deflected along the net, kept alive. Miller blocked along the net by Niambio. Thomas Ilara, strong dig from Hannah Grant following that attack, attack attempt. Lengthier point there goes to the Wolverine with that much of a back and forth so, so far in this game. So the Wolverines able, able to hold on to their six point lead with a one point lead. A little bit of a miscommunication on the back line, receiving that serve between Megan Miller. At least recently as the right side and been doing very well. That was a great swing down the line. Um, something that's not easy from the right side as a right-hander. Wolverines have to just punch it over. Big swing for Terry, dug up by, we'll say this a lot, Hannah Grant. The swing by Murray's blocked back down. Two-point lead for Illinois now. Wolverines out of system, but a good feed and a big swing from Merzik. Right, yeah, pretty evenly matched so far. Illinois has got a really interesting uh, serve-receive pattern here. Um, that seems to be working okay for them so far. A tip 
is put back onto Michigan's side. It'll lead to a swing from Merzik, and it's in down the line. The Illini will go to the middle. It's poked up in the air, kept alive, and just tapped over wow, and in. What a play. Great read by Hannah Grant picking up the kill. The third ace of the match for the Wolverines. Barnes, a great serve. Good pass forward. Great wow. dig by Grant. From the back row, Merzik off the top of the block and out of bounds for the kill. Caleb Burbage on the court. And a little bit of a miscommunication. Three Illini in the spot. We have seen the Wolverines just not go away. They're doing an amazing job. I don't know what the will is in their team, but they are able to just cut these runs and then make some of their own as well. And that's an ace. Nice double-double you mentioned earlier, Craig. Another point for the Wolverines. They got a three-point lead here. Really a big ask. Again, she was phenomenal last night. That time, though, just could not find it inside the line. Marissa keeps her serve and will go right back to Sire again in the same play set up on the opposite side, but Michigan does a good job to block that down. Dowler looking for Sire again. This one is dug out by the Wolverines. Now Layla Ricks with a go, and that one was blocked down by Haley Hallgren. But now Sam Sire, she gets a second crack at it, and she gets this one to go. That's her first kill of the day. Marilyn evens it up at one. See if the Terps can put that to an end. And Sire's kill attempt will be dug out by the libero. Here comes Hallgren again. And a nice dig by Gomillion, but a joust at the front of the net. Nice job by Jones to keep it in. Another tough play. And this one coming from Hallgren to flex off of Jones now to play. Michigan State up by four. It's a four-nothing run. And to serve is Hannah Grant for the Wolverines. Her serve is dug out by Nauman. Dowler will give it off to Sire. Sire tries to put it in a no man's land. A joust at the front of the net. It's kept in play by Jones. Now Nauman keeps it in play. Dowler looking at the opposite side. Layla Ivy, her kill attempt, far too much power on that one. Yeah, a lot of power behind that hit there. Just could not get that location right. Angles dug out. Joust at the front of the net, and that's too easy for Anastasia Rush. She puts it down. Hannah Grant with the serve, and that's going to be another service ace for this Michigan team. And boy, they're coming at a huge time. Nauman there on the near side. The serve from Grant. Sire has trouble with it. And Maryland will have to somehow hit this one over and, and unable to do it as Maddie Noman, that initial dig, put Maryland too much in of a wacky position. Keep their foot on the gas, unlike Maryland in set number one, who let them come all the way back. Russ trying to end the Michigan run. And Robinson puts it down, but a really nice dig comes from Gomillion. Good rally brewing, Sire. Dowler will set it up this time. Layla Ivy blocked down at the front by Robinson. Sire once again, she can't get it to go. Really, really good rally brewing. Then finally at the front of the net, it's Jess Merzik getting the better of Anastasia Russ and Sydney Dowler. Up until that. Serve kept in play. This one's going to be really difficult. It's not kept in play, actually. It goes behind the scores table. It's a service eight. It's really fun to watch the way defenses celebrate after getting a block, because it's like, it's crazy. It just, it just reminds me of, like, almost like you scored a touchdown in football. Everyone's going crazy for you when you come up with that defensive play. Maryland with some good defense themselves, and now Sire trying to reward them. And then front of the net looks like Maryland touched the net, and that's exactly what happened, and that will even it up at seven. That's the kill leader of Michigan, as we mentioned before. And she's doing just that today. She has 10 more than the second. Leading kill of Robinson. Have that momentum. Uh, actually deflects it off the net. It's an 8-0 run. Make that a 9-0 run as it's a service ace. And Bad pass. Grant uses hands. Good ball. Goes off the block and scores. Very fast tempo. The block was late getting there for the Hawks. Grant floats it over. McSweeney has to take it. That'll go for an ace. Dennis, good pass. Tessier, Casper, dug by Grant. Free ball coming over. Actually, got a swing at it. Vanderweide, Tessier, Casper's again. Dug up. Grant, good tip over. Tessier, Dennis outside Anabanjo. Block, 
Covered by Dennis. Tessier outside to Black. Dug by Grant. Tipped over. Caspers. Tessier. Black. Got a good dig from Grant. Right side. Tessier gets it up. That ball's out. It just sailed over. Good call there from Coach Rosen. Kind of switch into that middle mindset of you got to be everywhere on the net. Grant had good serve. Vanderwide with a bad pass. That'll go for an ace by the time it's all chased down, said and done. 10 8. Hawks fighting back. Dennis. Good serve. Grant, good pass. Dowd behind her. Off the block, dug by Dennis. Tessier outside. Vanderwide dug by Grant, but it's a bad ball. Dowd chases it down. Merzik from the back row. Oh, tough break there. Splits the block 24 22. She makes some plays that are just creative. And that was one it wasn't a good angle to hit from. She was able to keep it in play. Big swing from Kinkella. Dug up and it leads to the huge hit for Pertowski. Jess Robinson having pretty much a career year here in her senior year while Haley Halgren getting the first real chance here over the last few games to play and stepping up as Grant gets her hand underneath it. We've got cake and pancakes on <laughs> senior night. <laughs> The wall with the All-American banners and plate back down, but this time it goes into the crowd. Michigan leading by four and make it five. Off the tape and down for Hannah Grant. Five point advantage. Cross court angle. Grant dropping it in and getting the ace. It's a position and run those balls down. Michigan out of system and Murray terminates. Big smile on her face too. The last game at Chrysler Center for the season. And there's the aggressive serving at work. Job of taking this perfect pass, providing a great tempo, great location for her. That is service ace. For Grant. So Hannah Grant will serve it. And that is an ace. Grant floats it over and in service ace to start for the Wolverines. Angelina Stark can't get that one. And that one, Stark will receive that one. A miscommunication between her and Manny Belinovic. Cochran floats it over. Pedraza to Merzik, tipped at the line. Michigan gets set for an attack on the far side. Murray with a nice little dump play. Set back over by the blue and white. Murray again, another one. Floats over, received by the Nittany Lions. Merzik on the near side, that one received nicely and it just floats over. Grant gets her first service ace. She'd be looking to get going, and she's already got two today. And an ace. And that comes from this, the libero, excuse me, Hannah Grant. And another for Murray. And combined for 53 kills in those three matches, and they've got another race. 20 plus coming into this weekend. And they get another race, and it's eight in a row for Michigan. They've tied the first set up at 15. Play into their strengths. And another ace. The serving is on another level right now. This starting spot a couple matches ago and is now leading her team in kills this match. And another ace. And they're within two. That's another pancake for Grant. It's a kill for Murray Point, Michigan.